Hello and welcome to the um, 13th video, I believe. It's a bit unlucky for some, but the 13th video in my how to build a 4-bit computer inside Minecraft. In this video, I think I'll do the next screen, which is the screen that goes here, and then start on the horrendous task of decoding the 7-segment display. Um, I'm not going to rebuild this, I'm just going to copy and paste it across one. Um, so if you don't know how to build it, go and watch my previous video which I went through step by step in how to build it and my computer's just frozen. <sighs> what on earth? I've dropped a horrendous amount. Oh, there we go, okay. That, sorry about that lag. No idea why that happened. Okay, so uh, like I just said, uh, copy and paste this across one. In fact, you can actually stack it to do it in one step. Make sure you take it out one more than this and select that far block there. And then stack one. Like so. One thing I forgot to do is uh, select the repeaters, but no biggie really. One thing I have realized about this is <laughs> that the numbers are going... Oh. That hasn't worked quite as expected. I think. Is that an optical illusion? These actually in line. Yeah, these are in line. That's weird. One looks further back than the other one looks... Ah, right. That's why. What on earth has happened there? Oh, yeah, I forgot to add bomb bit but uh, we're gonna have to come and redo all of these well most of these pistons because flipping out that is a weird glitch yep these as well yeah I think it's when you stack powered pistons world edit does not like that at all okay so uh, just come and replace these pistons turn off the goddamn rain come to the bottom and redo these these are a bit awkward because you've got to get them facing the right way and the last two, which is that, like that, and that one like that, okay. So um, that is looking fine, except I've completely forgotten a segment, the middle segment. Okay then. Uh, so that, yeah, that it was a bit annoying, but it saved us a lot of time. But yeah, what I was saying was, um, I have noticed that these are quite far apart, so the two digits are going to look maybe a little bit silly, but it is better than nothing. Um, the next thing I'm going to do is add our, just like the board around it, so I'm going to take it out five, I think, one, two, three, four. Fine. I'll do it six for good measure and then select that position come up here and come out six five, six and select that and just put set wool so there we go that is our well that's a big screen considering it's only one to fifteen but oh well Um, now for the not so fun part. Um, the way this is going to work is the left number is obviously just going to be a nothing is going to be displayed or a one is going to be displayed. Um, and this it'll have it where one to nine, uh, zero to nine, sorry. So it'll go zero, one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine. And then uh, one, zero, one and one, one, two, one, three, one and four, one, five. So it's pretty easy on this on this part. Um, 
I'm going to have, let's have a look, uh, the first, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, the up to here, these can all be ignored, and then from here onwards, so that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, yep, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, okay, so from this one, we just need to add ones, which if you come back and look at the, uh, look at the displays, it's just these two far ones, so every one of these needs a uh, needs this and one more I think 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 okay so that's this one done and I think the pistons might have dropped the blocks oh no they haven't, that's good so yes that's that one done and I think that should be okay. Alright, now for um, this one. So the first number one is a 1, so we can come all the way back here, come in line where the 1 has been decoded and place a 1. A 2 is the middle 3. I'm going to try not to go back and have a look at the screen each time because that means it will take for ages. So 2 is the middle 3, the far 1. And that one, a um, what's next? One, two, three. So three is the middle three, and the two on the right. A four is what's the four? The top, the middle, and the the two right and the top left. So the middle. The top right, top left, bottom right, that's it I think actually, one, two, three, yeah that's it. Um, for the five it's kind of the opposite of the two, it's the, uh, it's the middle three but this time it's the far left, and the second from right. The six is uh, the two bottom ones, and the um, and then the middle two, uh, no, the middle segment and the bottom middle segment. I can't remember which one's the top middle and which one's the bottom middle. Which way around is it? Okay, so the one on the left is the top middle and the one on the right is the bottom middle. Um, so you need middle, middle and bottom middle, like so. Oh, and we also need one more, which is the top left. Okay, now for seven. Um, so two on the right and the top middle. Um, eight is all of them, which is handy. Nine is the top, like four, so it's top, no, that's bottom middle. It's top middle and middle middle, and it's top right, bottom right, top left. Um, now for zero, which is all of them except the middle segment. So this is now ten. So the first one and the zero. So it's one, two. Oops, not there. That one, that one, and that one. Eleven. So it's back to what we're doing before. 12, which is the 2, so it's middle 3. Um, what was 2? Yeah, like this. So that one, that one, 3, which is that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Um, 4, um, middle, middle, top right, bottom right, top left. And last but not least, which is a 5. Three middle ones, um, that one, and that one. Now to test out our invention. So then, from uh, from these, we've gone from a four-bit binary number to a seven-segment uh, display number, which is quite impressive. So um, I'll start by doing. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at a three. So one and two makes a three. 
and I've already encountered some problems. Oops, that's why I, uh, it's not a three at all, it's a, uh, I'm decoding the wrong one. Uh, sorry about that, the smallest bit is this side, not that side. Just delete these blocks while I'm at it. Okay, um, so three is that and that. One second, let me just reset this. Okay, there we go. So three is now in the uh, in the Aris Narlatch, which decodes this one. Comes across here, lights up these torches, which hasn't reached. Where have my? Oh, I forgot to. Uh, I forgot to add my repeaters on. Why didn't someone tell me? Actually, they might have done. To be honest. I'm recording this before I've uploaded the previous video, so... Yes. Sorry about that. I just got interrupted uh, by, my, by my dad. Um, so yeah, where was I? I um, uh, yeah, I think we just need to... Um, stack these repeaters. Oops. Redo that. Okay, take that one and that. Oh. Why won't it let me select that repeat? Okay, there we go. Let's stack that 13 times. Okay, so now that's done. Um, since these torches are on, these light up these three. And it becomes a three on the screen, which is really nice. Now, if we um, try num another number, uh, let's try fifteen. Might as well just update our iris null latches. Um, so now this uh, this line's been turned off, so the torch is coming through. And if we go onto our screen, <laughs> oh, have I done that for every single one? Oh, every single time there's a one I've to put it in wrong. On this one, it's uh, <laughs> it's not this number at all. It is like this. Sorry about that. Okay, so that's the uh, that's the one. So as you can see. 15. Um, sorry about the big gap, like I said before, there's not much I could do about it. Um, there's probably a way of making, well there is definitely a way of making this more compact so it comes out less, but you're still probably going to have to have it quite far away from each other. But that's looking pretty nice to be honest. <sighs> Let's try one more test, because I like it when things work. <laughs> um, let's try 12. Uh, which is 8 and 4 in binary. So which is the middle 2. Uh, the end 2, sorry. Okay, so that's 8 and 4, which is 12. Update our RS now latches. 12 is coming through nicely. Follow it down and look, 12 is being outputted on the display. So that is pretty super to be honest. I don't think that could have gone much better. Uh, so yeah, I'll just uh, re-add the uh, redstone here without destroying more blocks. So yeah, I, uh, I hope you found that quite informative. So if you didn't know how to build a 7 segment display, that's how you build it. So uh, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and subscribe.